boys, it's your man Vinny Keys, and it is playoff time in the NHL, so I know everyone's excited if their team's still involved in the playoffs, so what I wanted to do, I'm going to be doing a bunch of shootout commentary, and as much as I'm going to try to do it, uh, any team that the guy picks, I'm going to try and pick the team that that team is playing in the playoffs, because most of the time they're picking a team that is in the playoffs, um, and as much as I can, I'm going to put up every single series, I know the series have already started, I'm just going to give my predictions, and I want you guys to post in the comment section what you guys are going to think of the series, what you guys think of my comments, what you guys think you might might, might happen in the series or how many games it might go uh the first one we're gonna do the guy picked the detroit red wings um so i'm gonna go with the boston bruins which is obviously their opponent in the first round uh should be a great series detroit was playing unbelievable going into the playoffs it looked like they were the first place team in the conference and boston wasn't it was just one of those things you know what i mean like the teams that usually squeak in at the end of the day most dangerous teams that you're ever going to play against uh, i picked the team boston i'm going to usually pick the team that i think is going to end up winning the series uh that's who i think is going to come out on top in this not everyone's going to think i'm uh think i'm correct not everyone's gonna want me to be correct uh but unfortunately you know what i mean i mean being a leaf fan you know what i mean i see boston a lot and i know how they are you know what i mean they're just one of those teams they wear you down consistently throughout a series and they you know what i mean they just throw the body around they get away with so much dirty hits it's unbelievable like they're more so than any other team but then they complain about it so i don't know like i said it, it's just one of those things you know what detroit's gonna have to work really hard you know what maybe they can pull it off i could see it going seven games you know what i mean it's just just a great great team you know what i mean this year like i said a bunch of rookies that you know most teams don't get to have these types of rookies that come in like Nyquist, Tatar and all these people that are coming in and playing unbelievable uh you see here my first shooter go in there and I just missed the first one unfortunately but yeah like I said I'm just gonna talk more so about the series about what I think I said goaltending you know what I mean they're both okay you know what I mean for that like Rask is actually really really good I would say shouldn't say okay uh Jimmy Howard's you know kind of coming you know off of like the not the best year I guess you could say they've had uh, a lot of supporting cast and goaltending uh, obviously Gustafson the second he leaves Toronto goes has an awesome year in uh, Detroit but you know what I mean that's usually what happens so I'm used to that <laughs> uh, you see there a little flip goal between the legs which is beautiful giving me a one nothing lead um, but yeah you know what like I said uh, Boston it's uh, they're just such a tough team you know what I mean they wear you down like I said with all the body checking and now all the stuff they do throughout the series like you saw the 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 spear between the legs on from Lucic on the Detroit guy he only gets fined five grand no penalty on the play it's just it's stuff like that's got to be called you know what I mean I'm happy that they actually got it right with the Brent Seabrook uh, Brent Seabrook kit but we're going to get to that when I start to talk about the Chicago series I'm going to be doing one of these for each and every one of the series next series once uh, the second round begins i'm going to be putting up uh, before the series starts so we can kind of compare uh, what i think actually happens and then what actually does happen you know what i mean so we're going to go from there um but yeah they like said it's uh detroit they said they're going to be in tough you see he's buried one obviously just missed it there uh but yeah they said uh, we've got lucic coming in now on howard Let's see how he does here a little fake and drag oh the back end goes in beautiful oh man but um yeah you know what they like said uh, boston you know as the series goes on uh you you know what they, they've they've tied the series now i think like i said they're going to eventually wear detroit down as much as they can you know what they, the jetterberg's not expected to be back until at least the second round so you know what we'll see you got a little bit of a nicked up datsuk he's just coming off of an injury but we'll see what happens like i said i'm sure that they're going to give him all all that they can handle you see here another big player for the uh, boston bruins mr jerome ginla sticks it in the back of the net and uh yeah that was a, just a beautiful finish for us giving me the victory in the uh shootout commentary about the first series i was going to do this is like i said the boston again Against, or Boston against Detroit first round of the Eastern Conference uh, quarterfinals. Um, like I said, I'm going to be doing more series updates and whatnot as the series go on and as the winners get decided. Like I said, we'll check back soon. Like I said, we got the draft for the UOHL tonight, guys. So be ready for that and all the updates and who's going to be involved in that. So yeah, like I said, check check back soon. Subscribe to the channel. Leave a like on the video for more of this stuff, and we'll check. To, we'll talk to you guys later. It's your man Vinny Keys. We'll talk to you guys later. Peace out.